share in the stream. Oh, hello. Huh? I didn't say that. I, I got to cut this thing off as soon as it comes up. Huh. Jenna. What oh, is it? <laughs> Hi, Jenna. Hi, Sherry. Hello. Hey, Sherry. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Good. How are you? Good. I just woke up. Hey, Joe. Hi, Joe. I've been lazy all day. Everybody saying, hey, Sherry, hey, Amy. <laughs> Boo, Jen. We were just discussing our, like, our, when we have to write down notes. You know how you get these postcards of different places? Look at my stuff. I've got so much junk wrote all over them. I, and I got a notebook over here to write in. Hi, Rob. Hey, Rob. Well, Sherry, what did your mom think the other day? Um, she thought it was a little um, little different, a little weird. <laughs> the day just weren't talking like they usually are the other night. Well, that's what I told her. I says, usually it's pretty hopping in there. And I says, but not a lot of activity. And she says, well, I still feel that it's kind of weird. <laughs> But but then again, she said she wanted to do a private session with you. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we might change your mind. Yeah. Well, I th I still, I, you know, it's that whole thing with Todd, so. Yeah. I didn't know if that would, for, did it, I didn't know if it freaked her out when I asked if she wanted to, if he wanted to talk to his mom. I can't no. No, I think she believes that like she's being um, haunted by Todd or something. So, I mean, she definitely believes in it. She just thinks that it's like strange. Yeah. Hey, Kato. Joe said her screen is blurry. Mine looks good. Wait, let me look at the other day. I'm looking at the. Where's looks looks on my end? Uh... <laughs> I'm full of myself tonight. Hey, Chad. Hi, Chad. Hi, Troy. Hi, G Paul. G Paul. Hey, oh. Troy. How is everybody tonight? Hi, Ray Ray. Hey, Ray Ray. And Miss Amy. Y'all on here, Amy is so good with names. She can remember their names for everybody, and it just takes me a while. Like, it took me forever for um to remember Chad's name. It took me forever. I work around people every day. I have to learn their names. <laughs> I hear you. And everybody, I got a <clears throat> today. Oops, you don't need to see that either. <laughs> mail today. Just turn it over the other way. Yeah, I got mail today. <laughs> and it came from Canada. Doing pretty good. How are you, Troy? <clears throat> Excuse me. As to Joe. I hope not either. I don't understand why they're bombarding Amy the way they are. I haven't heard G call yet. I hear. Oh, okay. Him's here. Him is here. 
I'm not gonna be a real. It's not gonna be a real long live stream because I have to get up at five thirty in the morning again. <clears throat> I'm gonna try to sleep in a little bit till it's time for me to go to work. You gotta work tomorrow. Yeah. I'll get home probably about thirty minutes or so before the live stream. Good Lord. We have Nakona nuts tomorrow. I thought y'all just had that. No, we just had the Monday night dinner, and we just, we had the jam right before that, and the Nakona nuts before that. Now it's time for Nakona nuts again. Lord have mercy. But this is our last one, our last Nakona nuts till October. Good Lord. You did well. The house, I thought it was going to fall down. Ray does, Ray Ray does some awesome, awesome scoring too. And I just love when he goes to my, my parents' hometown. Because I'm like, I've been there. <laughs> But this came. So, wow, that place was bad. Glad I weighed 140 pounds. <laughs> All right, right. I ain't going there then. My Weight Watchers ain't working like it's supposed to. Yeah, me neither. I don't know. But this came from Sean Rockenbox. Yay, Sean. Which everybody, um, if you don't know, Sean Rock and Box and I share the same birthday. Yes, they do. So, um, I'm going to open this up. See what it is. He put so much tape on it, y'all. I don't even feel a piece of paper. On the <laughs> Except for the paper that's stuck on top. <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Just tear it. <laughs> I gotta try to find a place for them. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> Let's see. I don't want to lose his address. Let's see all. Remember, I said if I can. Yes, he is. Very, very. Ray Ray, this is the 25th of April. Cool, Beatsy. Beatsy. And my grandbaby is the 16th. Shana just went around the corner. Yeah. Her grandbaby's supposed to be here on the 30th of April. Thank you, Troy. And y'all pray for Lainey, too. She's coming down with something. Yeah, and Amy's dad and my dad continue prayers, and for Joe and everybody. Everybody. I hope little Elaine is feeling good better. Who? Your sister. Your sister. Shut up. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I can't like, the cred too, huh? Yeah, she and pray for my oldest daughter. She has a severe strep throat. Yeah. She opened her mouth today and I see blisters. This is I'm, I'm not really sick. I just don't have a voice and I have a cough that just won't like but I don't feel bad. Hey Michael. But it's ever since when did it? you ate that chocolate. Yeah, I blame the chocolate for everything that's happened to me the last couple of days. Oh, yeah, this is harder to do than getting into four knots. That's your present. You get to play with the knife and tape. What do you 
What? Casey said he wanted me to work for it. <laughs> yes, bro, that was the cutest pick. And I'm glad she's feeling better. It's a glitter bomb. Thank you, Ray Ray. That was a, a struggle in its way. <laughs> it was very well protected, that's for sure. Yeah, and he's got, hey, he's got the bubble pop stuff on it. Oh, Lord. So if y'all hear that, there's in the stream, y'all need to make it happen. Probably a real bomb. <laughs> Lord, he's got more tape. Oh my lord! Oh, that's good, Joe. Her notes have new chains, so now they can't get away from her no more. Yeah. Okay. Hey, this is what we said we needed to wrap around the swing, remember? Mm -hmm. I think you still need to. And Laney. Mm -hmm. Casey said, and Laney. Yeah, most definitely Laney. Right. I'm getting all oh, cool beans. Hold on a second. I'm still getting tape off. Well, this is the tape that's on the inside of the tape. Yep. Probably patient. He gave me some fresh kill con stickers. Yay. He gave me a little mm -hmm. ball. Oh, your favorite colors and your favorite animal. Oh, not animal, insect, whatever you want to call them. It's a little trinket box that he made himself. <laughs> That's awesome. That is pretty. And I'll put it in my hutch until I get my office room. Mm -hmm. As of about 11 o'clock this morning, Jenna, it's doing good. <laughs> That's awesome. Sean made this, Rob. He makes these little boxes. That is cute. They're called rocking boxes. Yeah, they're rocking boxes. And he makes yeah, just about anything. Put it on the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, but he says, no, 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 no. Oh, that is awesome. That's so nice. I didn't see it. That'd be a good box to put, like, your stones and crystals and all that in. Yep, sure would be. I like it. It's black and purple. If I can keep it away from Alan. <laughs> She's like, ooh, memo. Oh, wait a minute, here's something else. Oh, it's a magnet, too. Oh, cool. Cool beans. Sean, if you watch this, thank you, and I love you. I'll have to write him. That's awesome. He sealed it up tighter than Fort Knox. <laughs> All right. I figured tonight we uh, might do a little trivia first. I gotta go get my notebook because you know how it's always men against the women. So hold on a second. Mm -hmm. 
Hello, Abraxas. Hi, Abraxas. How are you? So are y'all ready for some trivia? Yes, ma'am. All right, now y'all know. Now, G Paul, you gotta take your microphone thing, y'all. I was gonna say, is panel allowed to play too? Or yes, ma'am. Okay, but we're gonna hear it before the chat does. Oh. So then, how do we do this? Um, I don't know. We may just have to help you watch for the people that get the answers right. I think we only we got what one, two men. Is Troy still here? Yeah, I think Troy's still here. Three. Four. Here. I think we got like four guys, and then one, two. Honey bugs, Joe. Michael, Rob, Gray, Braxis. So there's only two females. Troy. Y'all make sure y'all share the stream and smash the like. Got Joe, Jenna. Oh, I finally got the candy pop. Got Joe, Jenna, Rob, Abraxas, Ray Ray, Troy, Y'all want to wait a few minutes? Yeah, I would. Yeah, let's wait a few minutes. Everyone, if you will, share the stream. Two females and two Twinkies. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Hey, Joe. Yay, Joe, you're awesome. Cause, cause, you know, y'all. These these women are good on here at Trinity. Yeah. This y'all know. And a lot of it is going to be TV trivia. Jenna, but totally female. The last time I checked. <laughs> 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 yeah, they got like a 20 second delay. So, because <clears throat> I said thank you to Joe, and you said thank you to Joe about 20 seconds ago, and she's saying you're welcome. What did you say, Chief? Just on the panel alone, the odds are against the guys. The women, the last time we done some trivia, the women whooped some butt. But I think the, no, the men won the last one. Because remember, we were keeping tallies of who would win the most. And the yeah. women won the most of all the trivia. Yeah. I got, a little, I got a trivia for you. Oh, Lord. How long does it take to mail a package from the cone of Texas? I don't know because we're still both late. <laughs> How are you, Abraxas? It ain't going to happen, G Paul. We done figured that out. Hello, Joe, Abraxas. Joe said, be right back. No, the goats aren't loose. <laughs> hey, Lauren, there's another female. Hi, Lauren. Lauren, we're going to do some trivia here in a little bit when we get some more women in here. The kids are on the uh, what's that game? Maybe all the kids play Fortnite. Yeah. Yes, TV trivia tonight. Don't tread on. I can't see the light went out. Don't tread, Don't tread on, on me. 
It's a rattlesnake. <laughs> no, it's a snake. Is that a yellow, that a yellow cup? It's usually the flag. Huh? Can koozie. That's oh, a can koozie. I know the flags are usually like yellow and black. You can get the big flags. You know, Michael made a lot of sense the other day. Slim. Uh oh, uh -oh. we're in trouble. <laughs> you know where they're telling all these kids that go to the high schools and stuff that drive to school that they can't fly the flag in the back of their truck or mm -hmm. like they've been doing? What's the difference with a flagpole in the school grounds? True. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah. There's JC. Hi, JC. Hi, Rico. We're going to do some trivia. Trump, all my bros must be asleep. Well, there's more men in here than there is women, right? Yeah. There's more women in here. I think it's about time now. You got JC, Joe, Jenna, Lauren. There's Muggsy. Hello, Muggsy. Hey, Muggsy. I hate now, now it's more men again. Yeah. We're gonna do a little bit of trivia from older tri older TV shows. Yeah, I'm usually pretty good at that, but because that's basically all I watch, except for some of them. Well, if any of y'all on the panel want to jump in the chat, and then after the trivia's ever come back, you can do that if you want to. Rico broke one of his teeth on a jawbreaker. That's not good. That's not good at all. Listen to Rob. Okay, Rob. Right, okay, let's go now. <laughs> what should we do? Women, do y'all think y'all can take them in? Yep. <laughs> I was reading their minds. I have faith in them. Yeah. Okay, y'all ready? Come on, ladies. And I hope I don't read this wrong. There's Buddy. Hi, Buddy. Should I go ahead and give the women like five points already? Because they're so yeah. <laughs> I got Google ready to go. Oh, Lord, Jake Paul. Okay, here we go. First question. Hey, Siri. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to let you read the question to Siri. <laughs> <laughs> In the American television, oh, Robert, oh, hell no. <laughs> now remember, panel can't answer. Unless you get on the chat. Yeah. In the American television comedy. Hey, Krista, we're doing trivia. In the American television comedy, Laverne and Shirley, what was the name of the fictitious Milwaukee brewery? Now, it might be different for y'all chat, but whoever we see come up first gets it. In the American television comedy, Laverne and Shirley, what was the name of the fictitious Milwaukee brewery? I wonder how many people are Googling it. Joe's like, no idea. <laughs> Lauren, I don't know. Come on. Y'all can type past through on Google. Come on, ladies. Come on, come on, come on. Hi, Krista. 
All right, I think I know this one. But I can't answer, right? You get you should be able to answer now. No, it's not Milwaukee Brewery. Um is it the bottle? Do I, can I say it? No, yes. Wait a minute. Should we put a uh, time limit on uh, it? Somebody already said it. Yep, I think I think she could have said it because time they had already read the question, but little hey, that, that, was, that was just starter. How many seconds <laughs> would you put on this? I don't want to like thirty seconds or something. All right. Does anybody have a one of y'all have? A I do. Okay. Scott's Brewery was right, but we're that we're not going to give that to anybody because the time lapse so much. We're going to start fresh with the next question. Okay, you ready? Appearing on the show. Yeah, you're going to get 30 seconds. Appearing on the show in 1982. Who was the youngest person to ever host Saturday Night Live? Appearing on the show in 1982, who was the youngest person to ever host Saturday Night Live? Krista said Drew Barrymore, Adam Sandler, Michael J. Fox. I see Honey Bubs. Time's up. Bubs said it first. Who? Honey Bubs, Drew Barrymore. She was seven years old. Okay. Next question. Shown before a baseball game in 1941, the world's first television commercial advertised what product? Timer started. Shown before a baseball game in 1941, the world's first television commercial advertised what product? They're not full of paper cigarettes. <laughs> Shown before a baseball game in 1941, the first television commercial advertised what product? Not laundry detergent, not coke. Okay, nobody got that one. It was Baluva watches. Ew, I never would have got that. Me neither, because I ain't never heard of it. If they'd have said watch, I'd have probably gave it to them. Yeah. Hey, Amy, are you watching the uh, live stream also? Yeah. You might wait and see when she uh, says the question on there. And then start the timer. You're starting the timer before they even hear it. Let's just do it for like, because we're like 20 second lag. So we'll do it for 45 seconds. 45 seconds. We'll do that one. JC says I wasn't born yet. <laughs> okay, ready? Next question. What comedian took over as host of The Price is Right after Bob Barker retired in 2007? Oh, I wish I was playing. <laughs> honey Bubs got it. Go, Honey Bubs. I'm waiting until you completely read the question and then a couple of seconds and then I'll start it. Okay. <clears throat> Next question. You got to be fast with the fingers, y'all. <laughs> JC said, Drew, I don't know his last name. 
All right, here we go. Next question. Which actress played Lauren Miller, Alex's girlfriend, on the last two seasons of Family Ties? Which actress played Lauren Miller, Alex's girlfriend, on the last two seasons of Family Ties? And I never realized that's who that was. Mugsy on mine, it's on on mine. It says Honey Bubs said it first. Because I think ours go in at different times. Jenna said Tracy Pollen. No, ma'am. I wouldn't. I wouldn't cheat, trust me. Timer. Okay, nobody got that one. Because we're giving 45 seconds now. It was Courtney Cox. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did, now that you say it. I didn't know it was. I didn't know it till you said it, but now I remember. Okay, are y'all ready for the next one? Yep, Courtney Cox. Here's the next question. What three word parting catchphrase is engraved on voice actor Mel Blaine's gravestone? I don't even know who he is. Oh, now I know who he is, the answer. <laughs> what three word parting catchphrase is engraved on voice actor Mel Blaine's gravestone? He's famous for something, a catchphrase he says. Rob said that's all, folks. Yep, that's all, folks. Rob got it. But they, but they, but they, but they, that's all, folks. <laughs> so it's two women, one the men. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm keeping track too. Okay. Hello, Donna. See, my, the, the, the chat's coming up. You're sitting before I am. Hey, Donna. Next question Who was the host? Oh. <coughs> Who was the host of the American Travel and Food Show, No Reservations? I know it, I know it, I know it. <laughs> Amy's going nuts. Amy <laughs> probably knows it too, so she does look like she's a chef. Close, Jenna. Jenna said Andre Bourdain, but that's not. <laughs> that's not right. correct. I can see his face right now in my mind. As soon as you hear his who, name, you'll know. Who was the host of the American Travel and Food Show, No Reservations? JC got it. Anthony Bourdain. Uh, just in time, JC. I can see his face, but I can't think of time. He just passed away not too long ago. You were so close, Jenna. Is he the one that killed himself? No, he had like a massive heart attack or something, didn't he? What's no, he did. He, he, no, he, he hung himself. Is that who that was, the one that hung himself? Yeah, Anthony Bourdain. He hung himself. Okay, next. That was pretty sad. He ate some wild stuff. Doesn't he have like salt and pepper color hair real tall? Yeah, he always smoked yeah. on the... Yeah, he yeah, is... Yeah. So, I didn't know he hung himself. Yeah, he committed suicide. Okay, next question. 
Are y'all really? In the sitcom Family Matters and, and film Die Hard, actor Reginald Bell Johnson's character had what occupation? See, I knew a lot of these. Rob said cop. Yep, Rob got it. Okay. Two to three, y'all. Who plays the role of Frank Reynolds in the comedy series It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Who plays the role of Frank Reynolds in the comedy series It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Jenna got it. Little Danny DeVito. Jenna, you got it right, and then you said you have no clue. <laughs> okay, it's next question. What lace, uh, lace, <laughs> what late this jockey was the voice of Shaggy in the cartoon Scooby Doo? Where are you? Oh, come on. You know, I this was jump off, I want to jump off panel and like go into. <laughs> I said you could if you wanted to. I should. And then jump back on when we get done. Okay. G Paul, you anybody can. Casey Kasem, Rob said first. Rob got it. Because mm -hmm. it is Casey Kasem. Yep. Sherry's debating. Hey Donna Rad, how are you? Okay. JC said, wait. Yeah, he spelled Casey Kaysen. I'm not going on spelling as long as I can see that's what it is. Sherry, Sherry's out there now. <laughs> hey, Shanda. Is it Shanda? Mm -hmm. Hey, Shanda. See, I'm not Hi, Shanda. Next question. What Star Trek The Next Generation actor hosted the children's show Reading Ring? It's not Levert. Lamar Burton. It's what? Lamar Burton. It's not Lamar. Jordy. Lever Burton. Krista got it the name right. It's Lavar. Lavar. Burton. Okay. Next question. But you were close, Sherry, because you had love. L A V. Okay. 
Here we go. Who starred alongside Ed, Eddie Albert in the television sitcom Green Acres? Oh, Lord. See, Twinkie, these are good ones. Mm -hmm. Amanda said it. <laughs> Who starred alongside Eddie Albert in the television sitcom Green Acres? Sherry got it. Okay. Ava Gabor. Come on, man. Lisa Gabor. Okay. What are you laughing at? Who? Me. I'm not. It sounded like you were laughing. Mm -mm. Okay, next question. It's six to three, y'all. Made up predominantly of young men, adult fans of the animated television series My Little Pony are known as what? Made up predominantly of young men, adult fans of the animated television series My Little Pony are known as what? I didn't know this one. Krista said bronies? Yep. Yep, Krista got it. I never heard of it. Oh, me either. <laughs> Rob said <so> confused. <laughs> Brownies confused. <laughs> oh, shoot, that's a shot. Got it at a lid. Okay, next question. Who tries for East? Leachman for the most Emmys won by a female performer. I'm not even sure who that is. Who ties Clarice Leachman for the most Emmys won by a female performer? What? What does she want? Um. He needs you to come in. Thank you. I'll be right back. Okay. I know the thing's going to go off. I'm going to go see what Casey wants real quick. Okay. Tony Orlando. No. The female. Erica Kane. Hey, I wrote all the answers down that came in before the timer went off. So we'll find out when Twinkie gets back. I would have said someone like Betty White too, but I'm not sure what the answer is. So we have Erica Kane, Julia Dreyfus, and Betty White. Yeah, Susan Lucci. That would not surprise me one bit if that was it. She got a lot of daytime movies, didn't she? I 
actress Gloria was on Dancing with the Stars. She was on Dancing with the Stars when she's in her 70s or 80s. Oh, Lord. Sorry, y'all. Okay, we got Erica Kane, Julia Dreyfus, or Betty White? It is Julia Dreyfus. Julia Dreyfus. So Krista got it. Sherry's was a good guess, too. So was Rob's. <laughs> I could see it being any of them. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight to three, guys. Ladies are. Okay. In what city would you find the Wizard of Oz? I see them coming up quick. You see them before I do. No, nah, I mean, I'm, I'm going to see them like all writing them at one time. Yeah, Rob got it. Emerald City. Yep. Rob got that Let me one. say Kansas City. <laughs> no, because they say they're not in Kansas anymore. Yeah. Hollywood, California. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? Next mm -hmm. question. Where does SpongeBob SquarePants work? Oh, Lord. The moon. Yeah. Ricky's like, I really need to be in there. It worked on the moon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's no place like home. There's no place like home. Michael said Krusty Krab. You got it. Women, men are making comeback, women. Yeah, pretty quickly, too. It's five to eight now. Okay. Hi, Kentucky. Hey, Kentucky. Megzi said the moon. <laughs> okay, next question. What is the color of underdog's cape? Mm. Hey, Rick. Kendrick's in here. Thank you. I can, Rick. Kentucky said red. Nope. Did I say now? No. <laughs> Rick said. Purple, Krista said blue. Blue. Yep. I gave time. I could have said. <laughs> I knew it was blue. I would have got that wrong because I thought it was red. But I think his shirt was red. Cape was blue. Krista said red sweater. <laughs> Orange. Orange. Okay, next question. What 1985 through 1992 sitcom earned Emmy Awards for its four star all women over the age of 50? <laughs> Jenna said Golden Girls. Okay. First one I seen was Jenna. Yeah, Jenna. Yeah. There's, there's a guy that has an alpaca farm and he's got four alpaca, female alpacas. And he's named each one of them after the Golden Girls. <laughs> Donna said Medea. <laughs> oh, Lord. Let's see. It was Blanche. Rose. Rose. Dorothy. Dorothy and uh, Ma. Sophia. And Sophia, yeah. 
Who was the youngest of the Golden Girls? Went like in real life or yeah. on the show? Dorothy, I think. It was, I thought it was Sophia. It was the mother. Yep, Sophia. They dressed her up to make her look older. Well, yep. you know, uh, in, they said that Granny Clampett was a lot younger than what she was. Yeah. Uh, so how many Granny Clampets were there? Oh, that I can tell you. No. How, how many was there? I don't know, but there's a few of them. All right, the next question. The live action superhero television series Mighty Morphin Power Rangers premiered in what year? Yeah, you lost me there. <laughs> I never could get into that show. I couldn't either. <clears throat> 1992. Was it 92, Twinkie? Yeah, 92. Nope. Nope. Oh, yeah. Was it 93? Yep. 94. I said no. Rob got it. it. first, yep. Next question. Are you looking this stuff up, Krista? Yeah. That was the exact day. <laughs> what television host quipped, uh, quipped at his 1990 wedding? The answer is yes. That makes sense. What television host whipped it at his 1990 wedding? The answer is yes. So who said the answer is yes? The answer is yes. So who said that at his wedding? Bob Barker. <laughs> Music. No. Alex Trebek. Okay, Sherry got it. What I was going to say was Alex Trebek. All right. Next question. <clears throat> what was the name of the coffee shop in the hit sitcom Friends? I knew that one. Mm -hmm. Rick said, who is Alex Trebek? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it wasn't Duncan's. <laughs> yeah, the Honey Bub's got it. Honey Central Bubba. Park. Central Park. Twelve to six. Corner coffee shop. <laughs> All right, next question. Who played the fictional character uh, Phoebe Buffet mm -hmm. on the American sitcom Friends? Mm -hmm. And Phoebe is not. The way it's wrote does not look like it be Phoebe. Mm -mm. Looks like Phoebe. Yeah. Jenna got it. Yep. Jenna got it. This is Ray. Yeah. <laughs> this is Ray. You're asking questions that only women would know. Just as many men watch Friends. They just aren't going to admit it. I didn't watch that stupid show. 
Oh my I goodness. That lady gal. Lady gal. All right, next question. Who was the star of the popular 80s crime drama Magnum P.I.? Mm -hmm. Nope, buddy. Buddy, yeah, the stare at said, Jenna, isn't it your bedtime? <clears throat> Tom Selleck. Abraxas. Abraxas got that. Okay. Mustache blue bloods. <laughs> Next question. Hey, boo boo. Let's go get a pick. A uh, Nick Basket is a famous line often said by which cartoon character? <laughs> hey, boo boo. Hey, boo boo. Hey, boo boo. Let's get us a pick and look at Basket. JC, we're, we're taking the answer that shows up first on our screens. It may show up first on your screen, but on our screen, it shows up him first. All right. If that Yogi. Said Yogi. Yogi. Yeah. So you guys got that one. Yeah. And a breakfast under him said Yogi, or was it a breakfast under him said Yogi Bear? Yeah. Yeah, boo boo. Let's get us with picking the Kabaski. <laughs> get that. I can't spell. <laughs> All right, next question. What does the Muppet Oscar the Grouch live in? <laughs> Thomas is Smokey Bear. No, he prevents for forest fires. Ranger or Kentucky said trash can. No, um, JC. We're not making them as we go. It's sometimes when y'all type in, it, it comes up different on the streams who's first. And so we're using who comes up on the screen first. That's the only way we can be fair. Because if y'all type enter at the same time, it's going to show up as your first on your screen. But on ours, it'll be who actually was in first. <laughs> That, that's what causes so much trouble with the trivia streams is the. <clears throat> you get you Betty. 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 From the 1960s television cartoon, The Jetsons. Oh. <laughs> 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 Abraxas. Abraxas. Men are catching up. Elvis rays of the sun, Sherry. Ain't the sun Elroy? Um, yeah. All right. There there are three, three from different. <laughs> no, you don't, JC. It's just having fun. Okay, next question. Which formal... Which former teen idol gained popularity playing the role of Molly Stewart on the Disney Channel television series Hannah Montana? Which former teen idol gained popularity playing the role of Molly Stewart on the Disney Channel television series Hannah Montana? Kentucky got it. 
Casey said it's at the same time he's sick and took it. Mm -hmm. The Chucky Dart. What is the brand name for the product that has a mascot of a muscular man with a shaved head oh, with an earring? Mm. I can't stand her either, Sherry. Kentucky said Mr. Clean. Come on, ladies. The men are catching up. Yeah, they're only one away from catching up. What you talking about, Willis? Was a catchphrase spoken by the actor Gary Coleman on what American television show? I know, oh, I know these. <laughs> <laughs> what you talking about, Willis? <laughs> What you talking about? Cherry Keggs. Cherry got different strokes. Who did? Cherry. Okay. Okay, y'all ready for the next one? America's Next Top Model is an American reality TV show created by which former model? Oh, Mort. <laughs> I'm hurt you with every question. <laughs> no. no. Suzanne Summers. <laughs> no. Nope. <laughs> Caitlyn Jenner. Oh, my Lord. A female's got it anyway. Tara Braxton. Tara and Krista Satara. Who got it? The females. Krista and Honey Bows. Okay. Wendy Williams. <laughs> Shirley T. Wendy oh. Williams. This is Wheelie. Well, Wendy Williams is getting divorced. Oh. Paul's one of uh, made up that show. Huh? RuPaul done it. RuPaul, oh Lord. <laughs> oh, my. Hey. Anonymous, how are you? Next question. What is the stage name of a member of Public Enemy who would later have a reality dating show? Bye, what? Huh? I was telling Donna bye. Yeah, bye, Donna. Thank you for coming. Play the flave. Yep. Kentucky. I love that show. I don't care who says they didn't like that show. I love that show. <laughs> What's the score? It's thirteen to fifteen. Women. Guys are winning, huh? Girls. Next question. What is the name of the American animated sci-fi sitcom about the misadventures of a bad scientist and his grandson? Are you okay, Twinkie? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Kentucky. Kentucky got it. Mm -hmm. This is what sucks about not having TV to watch. I don't think I've ever watched Ricky and Morty. Okay, so the guys need one more to tie it. I haven't had TV in over four years. Okay, next question. What type of animal is Looney Tunes fictional character Foghorn Jay Leghorn? 
Ja, så är jag så jag så är Ja, så tagen. Tad. Men, 15 the ladies. Okay. Rhode Island Red. <laughs> Next question. How many castaways were there on the American sitcom Gilligan's Island? Oh, Lord. Hmm. No. Nope. Nope, nope. JC got Yep, seven. The professor is always forgotten about. <laughs> what is it? No, uh, Mr. Mrs. Howe. Yeah. Um, Ginger. Marianne. Marianne. Gilligan. Um, Skipper. And the professor. Mm -hmm. Kentucky said 30. 32. <laughs> well, next question <coughs> Orphan Black is a sci fi television series filmed in which country? No, I don't know that one. I've never heard of it. Orphan Black is a sci-fi television series filmed in which country? Thank nope. Nope. Day. Nope. Africa. No. Nope. England. Nope. The timer's going. Europe. That wasn't the time or now. No. Uh, Krista. Krista. In Canada. I was like, surely, surely I thought that uh, Jenna was there <laughs> to get it. <laughs> Great. Why is that phone acting good? Next question. Jenna said, oh my God. <laughs> it's filmed in Canada, but it takes, it said, um, which um, television series filmed in which country? So it asked for where it was filmed at. Yes, ma'am, it was filmed there. Filmed there. Next question. Let's see, we're gonna go. Let's see, we've already got. It's fifteen to seventeen now. What should we go up to? Maybe twenty. Was it only three more questions, or how many more questions you got? Oh, tons. Maybe should we go, go up? Go to twenty-one. Huh? Go to twenty-one. We'll, we're going to go to 21 then, y'all. Then we'll save some for next week. Watch Amy say, I'm not going to be on here in the panel. <laughs> next question. Which actress plays the female lead in the American crime thriller television series, The Blacklist? Sure, it's a good Googling, Krista. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which actress plays the female lead in the American crime thriller television series, The Blacklist? Everybody's Googling it right now. I know. 
Kentucky said that there lady with the black hair. Oh my God. Diana Ross's daughter, shit, what's her name? <laughs> Never heard of Blacklist. Me neither. It's a good show. Not the guy from Lost. <laughs> Bro, he with him. Tell you what, after it, if they, nobody guesses it after the buzzer, if either two of y'all have it, Winky or G Paul, we'll do it that way. But it's after the buzzer. Man. They, Krista got it. Yep. Google Play. Google. Next question. Hey, Siri. <laughs> <laughs> Which actress played the genie in the American comedy sitcom I Dream of Genie? Did you just smack the table, Twinkie? Mm -hmm. Did you just smack the table? <laughs> Barbara Eden. Mm -hmm. Rick. Well, the reason we're given 45 seconds, um, Kentucky, is because there's a... A lag, oh, there's a lag. Twinkie. That yeah, yeah, there's like 20 second lag. There's like a 20 second lag. So I start mine when she reads it. I'm hearing her in real time, and then you are hearing it after, so. <laughs> Rick's it's, yeah. it's 18 to 16. Females. Okay, next question. Torchwood, ugh, Torchwood is an anagram and spinoff of what popular British sci-fi series? Torchwood is a spinoff of what popular British sci-fi series? Doctor Who. Jenna got it. Mm -hmm. Guys, the ladies only need two more. Okay, this one's out there for those Star Trek buffs. Star Trek. The next huh? Nano Nano. The Next Generation Origin oh. originally aired in what year? I don't know this one. I was never I wasn't in the Star Trek. The Next Generation originally aired in what year? 1904. Like I said, 1904. <laughs> 1979. Krista got it. 87. Mm -hmm. Okay, they only need one more. Guys, female need one. Y'all need five. Next question. What is the longest running U.S. primetime television show of all time? Michael said gun smoke. <laughs> the longest running U.S. primetime television show. Rob said The Simpsons. Rob got it. Yeah, because they have Treehouse of Horror every year, and I think now they're on like year 30. 
30 something. Next time we do this, I'm going to say, can't Google it. <laughs> okay, next one. Okay, y'all ready? What is Michael J. Fox's middle name? <laughs> what? No, what? Nope. Krista got it. Yep. Andrew. It doesn't have a J in it at all. <laughs> I've done this question on our deal before and it threw everybody for a loop. So the ladies want it. No, oh, Google want it. That's all right. But it but next time we're gonna try it, we don't want to use Google. You know, if everybody, but that way you know how you see how much you know. You know what I mean? I guess it's really whoever the quickest typer is. Yeah. We're just playing it for fun. You won the right to say you won. <laughs> We're gonna do this again next week because I'm, gonna, I'm gonna mad that you didn't type faster. <laughs> Try like cheated. We got plenty more next week. But see, this is how it started off the last time, and then the guys started coming back. What's today's date? Twelfth. For another two minutes. Oh wait, no, it's the thirteenth for you. Well, we started on, started on the 12th. And next week, we'll do some more. If y'all guys are going to be ready to take on the females again. Guys have Alexa, Siri, and Google on standby. <laughs> We might even do it too some Tuesday night. If y'all want to. Did everybody like that? Buddy, you're lucky I'm at work. I would have won. <laughs> we will be doing some of that too. Look, Michael wants to do the music trivia. Now, Twinkie and Sherry... And Michael's smart for his age on, on music trivia. Next week, I'll feel dumber. Don't say that, JC. <coughs> I wouldn't have time either to Google something in... And I could use my Siri like crazy. You see, I'm always on the panel. I can type fast, fast, but most of those I knew before. I mean, I knew anyway. I think I had about five out of all those. Hi, traveling bunny. Chris has said it helps to have more than one device. <laughs> I hate TV a long time. <laughs> it helps to have more than one device. Now, as far as like the shows, you know, if it's older shows, I'm good at it. The newer shows and stuff like that, there's only a few I'd be good at. So, Krista, you did use Google? <laughs> she said it helps to have more than one device. You just told on yourself. 
I hate TV long time. <laughs> JC. Music, I'm, I'm too good at that I will beat the man up too much. Yeah, you were doing really good one night. You and Twinkie were... Y'all were doing really good one night. And the men were like, Sherry. I remember that. College screen proves it's all fake. Had to party and come back to defeat. <laughs> yep, y'all y'all did. Uh, what was the final score? Um, 21 to 17. 21 to, that was a close game, though. Y'all men came back real quick. I didn't know what, JC. Yeah, we need potty powder. <laughs> For. Just call me the cable guy. I love the babysitter. Oh, Lord. Yeah, we know about the college scam. Oh, yeah. Paying for their kids to go to school. Joe, we thought the new chain broke and you were out chasing the goats. Goodbye, Braxis. Goodbye, Braxis. <laughs> Glad you're back, Joe. Okay, now I'm going to the powder. Since everybody keeps saying powder. <laughs> trying to save this page. I'm proud of my ladies. Y'all better, y'all men better be spiffed up ready for next week. Joe, you fell off to sleep. Hey Siri, who's better, men or women? Hey Siri. Yes. Who is better, men or women? In my realm, anyone can be anything. Really? See, anyone can be humans, as you thought. That's in her realm. We're talking ours. So what do you want me to ask her next? Oh, I'm sorry, Joe. Buddy so is <laughs> Joe, if you need to lay down, sweetie, and rest, I understand. Joe, I just hope that when I turn the sphere box on, I don't want to make you, your head hurt worse.
Okay, but if the spirit box starts bothering your head on and you want to leave, I completely understand. Joe's getting her some R and R. Surprise James wasn't in here tonight. Why he? I know he uh was out doing orders and stuff today, I think, so <clears throat> I don't know where he's at now. I was supposed to go by there today and get my cross, but it have to be tomorrow. All right, all right, y'all. I be creeping and have some work that. That not good to take all the time. JC wants to know how you felt waking up today, Twinkie. Today was okay. Yesterday was a not so good day. <laughs> I thought you were going to say a pain in the arse. <laughs> Literally, no. <laughs> That's okay, Michael. I understand. It takes some getting used to. I completely understand. Joe has painkillers. All right, is everybody ready for the spirit box? Yes. Okay, make sure you have your earbuds out. And I'm going to start this for a few minutes, and then I'm going to go to the powder. Okay, Twinkie? Yes, ma'am. All right, here we go. That sounded like it said Twinkie. Say what? Did that sound like it said Twinkie? Did you say Twinkie? Y'all hear that okay? Yep. Good evening, Spirit. I just heard hi. Hurry back, Jenna. Spirit, can you come talk to us, please? <laughs> That is her angel. Her angel. 
How many spirits are here with us? Give me a number, please. Can you repeat how many spirits are here with us? Give me a number, please. Sorry. Yes, JC, um, I do. Once I get started, um, if you'll give me a few minutes, all I want to know is his name or their name. I don't want to know what happened to them or anything else. I just want to know their name. So give me a few minutes to get warmed up and we will do that. And I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you for making the meter go off. Guess their first name. But give me a few minutes. Bring him over into the bathroom real quick and then I gotta go. I'll be right back. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Good night, Rob. <laughs> Who is here with us? Can you give us a name, please? Thank you, Twinkie. There's six people here. Six money. Money. I heard him say money. Is there anybody on my chat you'd like to talk to? Perfect. Who is here with us? Give us your name, please. If there's somebody on my chat that you'd like to talk to, say their name, please. There's a name that comes here, but I'm not so exactly that is it anymore. So they said it really bad. Can you say that name again, please? Say your name, please. <laughs> or if you want to, or if you want to talk to somebody on the chat, say their name, please. <laughs> What about a boat? No. Thank <laughs> you. 
Can you come talk to us, please? Tell us what your name is, please. Fisherman? Something about <laughs> where you killed his sea out in the water. <laughs> you can come and talk to us, we won't hurt you. Jenna said she can see her. Yes. Did you get her killed out at sea, out in the water? Thank <laughs> you. 
Bring the top ten. Is your name T? JC, what is your friend's name? I heard dead. Thank you for making the light go to red. Is Pete or Rick here? If so, say your name, please. I, I swear I heard it say it stinks. So it might have been me meaning it stinks. I'm dead. We know you're dead, but can you come and talk to us? Okay, Jenna. Pete or Rick, are you here? Regina, is that your name? The female that keeps coming through? My brother in law is it. No. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, buddy. Carol Ann? One. It could have been Carolyn or Caroline. I have a Caroline, but she's still living. <laughs> Don't have to hurt it again. Is there a Caroline here with us? The meter jumped up too. Pete, Rick, are you here with us? Okay, Joe. Thank you, Miss Hopkins. Lisa? Purple. <laughs> 
Who is here with us? Say your name, please. One at a time. Hard. Burning. Heard hello. Anytime that you want to come and come through and talk, you're more than welcome to. Also, Todd, Cody, or Poncho. Hey, April. and rotate. Spirits, please come talk to us. Yeah. 
Who keeps saying my name? Make that meter go to red, please. Welcome back, Jenna. I just start breathing. Like I've exhaled. Thank <laughs> you. 
making the the exhale sound. That it was slim. That's what it doesn't sound like it's coming out of the spirit ball making the spirit. Explanation. Ready. Whatever. If there's somebody here with me right now, right here, please make that meter move. Who keeps whispering in my ear? Say your name on the spirit box, please. Thomas? 
There's a thing right next to me, I'm burning up. No, I'm not scared. Um, it doesn't feel like it's bad. I just, I just the thought of not knowing who it is. <laughs> Tell me what your name is. Give us your name, please. Rick, Pete, Todd, Poncho, Cody. Waiting. Well, come and talk to us. You don't have to wait anymore. Thank <laughs> you. 
Cody or Jody? Is Cody or Jody here? Is that you, Cody? Can you come and talk to Amy? Did you just say Ian? Can you please come talk to us? Come talk to us now. Thank you for making the meeting room. Welcome back, Terry. Always. If you're here to talk to Amy, can you move that meter, please? Did I hear Cody or Jody? Okay, JC. Yeah. And then I heard, yeah. <laughs> Say your name, please. Come up to the front and talk in this little black box so we can hear you. Hey, Shadows of the Moon. Thank you for making that meter go off. Yeah. <laughs> Can you tell me your name, please? I heard a female say hello. Welcome here, Shadows of the Moon. Tell us your name, please. Excellent. Excellent. There's people that 
they come from all over around here, uh, in here tonight. You're more than welcome to talk to any of them. Just tell us your name, please. How many spirits are in here with us right now? Give us a number, please. Say hey. Eighteen. Did you say eighteen? Concert, Todd, Keith, Rick. If you're here, come talk to us, please. Hey, fat boy, how are you? Write it in the chat. Fat boy, you know us Twinkies are always together in here. Can y'all make the lights move on the meter, please? Put all your energy together. I said if you wear earplugs, you can hear words better. That one. Can you say your name, please, so we can all hear you? Uh -huh. 
I like it like that. Like it like that. I love you. Oh Lord, that boy, you crazy. Yeah, it is here too, JC. Um, thank you for coming. Um, just the talk to your friend or whatever, let them know that it's safe to come out on this channel. And maybe he'll come through next time. We can always try again. Good night, JC. You have a sweet dream. You're very welcome. Love and hugs to you, JC. Thank you for making the lights light up. There's a crow going crazy at the front of my house right now. Really? I heard a female say hello. Can you tell us your name, please? I 
I believe in you. Can y'all make them light up, please? <laughs> I want to be seven. Are y'all trying to be stubborn? <laughs> There's so many good people in the chat. Don't you want to show them what you can do? <laughs> That's it. You can do it. <laughs> Can you take it one light higher? We got Joe and Jenna and Pointy and Deepo. Shadow of the Moon. And many, many others in here. Sherry Kay. Sometimes they like to crazy um shadow of the moon. And they'll be constantly striking on red. <laughs> Cody, Poncho, Todd, are you still here? Poncho or Cody, what is in Amy's house? <laughs> Already two teen here, sir. I gotta get up at five thirty, so you need some talk to us. Outside of Default's house, are you trying to give him a sign? Talking, but I couldn't make it what you said.
Spirit, are you at peace? Can you tell us what heaven looks like? <laughs> Three. Why are y'all being so quiet? This may be closed. You're more than welcome to speak. Can you tell us how you passed away, please? Thank you for making the light go off. Start the female said, hey you. Welcome back and to let them go. Clear, Charlie. Is there a Charlie here?
Ferris, y'all got about eight more minutes. Oh, okay, Tim. Okay, Shadow. Ferris, do you want to talk to anybody before we go on the live chat? It might be because of deer we um we're supposed to get that morning. I'm not gonna be on this longer anyway. Talk to Amy before we go. Uh-huh. 
comes up every night. Can you tell us how you died? Who said G Paul? Welcome back, Shadows. If he passed, Joe. Everybody check out Shadows of the Moon. Show some love. Welcome back, people. Everybody butter some buns. Shadow, we don't say um the sub word. We call it butter and buns. Since they don't like us saying that word. Everybody in here is awesome people. You won't find a better bunch of people to be affiliated with. Hey, Slam. It's nice to meet you too. Hey girl, I heard you say hey girl. Hey girl. 
Everybody, don't forget, I do fair boxes on Tuesdays and Fridays. And what the panel of Twinkie will be on Wednesdays and Saturdays. So don't used to be one more night, y'all. And George Hustle will be on Sunday. And we're trying to get G Paul to start up so he can start doing some live streams. Awesome shadows. This is a great community to join. <laughs> And as closer the closer that our reunion gets, um, we'll probably be talking about it more and more. Um, anybody that's here that doesn't know, we're having a YouTube family reunion in Tennessee from July 8th through the 11th. We have a hotel uh, already reserved for anybody that wants to come. Um, it's uh, $90 for three nights and then $30 for your, uh, we're having a banquet on the last night for a catered dinner so we can all be together. So all of y'all make sure, um, if you're interested, hit What's the Paranormal or myself up. Okay, spirits, we're going to get off of here for tonight. That'll be awesome, Kim. Spirits, when I turn this box off, you cannot connect yourself to me or anybody in my home. Now they want to talk. They do this every time. Yep. Um, Shadows, if you want to check out the Facebook page for the reunion group, um, right there is the link. Thank you, Pointy. Um, when I cut this off, you cannot connect yourself to me or anybody in my home. You cannot connect yourself to anybody on my live stream or just get on my live stream. You must go back to where you came from. Only good spirits are, are welcome. You can come back at the next appointed time. <laughs> Our Father, who art in heaven, I will be thy name. The kingdom that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. You can give us our trespasses. You can give us our trespasses. You can give us our trespasses. You can give us but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Good night, spirits.
slim. I think they're everywhere. So shadows of the moon. Um, I'm not sure where you're located at. Uh, Joe says, yes, Mike, New Zealand. Um, I forgot what I said. Oh, yeah, I, I'm, I don't know where you're located at, but our next reunion, we had it in Colorado last year. Oh, you're in Alaska. Cool beans. We have Alaska, Canada, New Zealand. We had Australia. Australia comes in here. People from all walks. So everybody in here is welcome. But we're gonna we're gonna be doing a family reunion every year. And it's once a year, and then as soon as we announce the new uh when we do have the reunion, we're gonna announce the place for next year. And you have a year to save up for it, plane tickets, all that good stuff. So you'll have a year to save up. Oh, I'm sorry, Jenna. You're originally from Western New York. Awesome. So since if you can't make it to this one, um, hopefully you can make the one to next year. But like I said, we're not going to announce that until the banquet dinner. But everybody, I'm going to let you go for tonight. And everybody, make sure you check out Twinkie tomorrow night. I don't know what she has planned, but you know it's always good. Nothing hot. Yeah, she's done with the hot stuff. Y'all can turn your speakers back on G call. I always forget. <laughs> You're originally from Indiana, Tim. That's where G call lives. You're always welcome, Jenna. And we'll do some more trivia games. Tuesday night and spirit box. If nothing happens. Hopefully you know. I hear you. All right, everybody, you have an awesome, awesome night. I love y'all. Thank you for coming. Thank you, Twinkie and G Paul. You're very welcome. Peace, love, and hugs, everybody, and we'll see you on What's the Paranormal stream tomorrow night, a.k.a. my Twinkie. What night, y'all. Love you. Love y'all. Good night. Thank you all for being here, and nice to meet you, Shadows of the Moon. Cool beans.